Right, in this video, we're going to show you how to use uh, one of the older Casios to calculate um, the, an estimate for the mean data in a grouped frequency table. So a frequency table means that you have frequencies, as in the how many. Uh, grouped means that you have groups. So this is not a specific number of pens. It's, it's within a range. So all these 10 people in here have either 0, 1, 2, or 3 pens. So it's a group. And you fall within the group if you have that amount. Right, so if we're going to do that, we need to go menu and we need to go to stat. So stat is over there. Um, we need to put the data in. So what you can't put in is 0 to 3. You have to put in um, the midpoint. So what you do is assume that everybody has that 1.5 pens. 1.5 is the midpoint of 0 and 3. If you're not sure about that, just do 0 plus 3 and then divide by 2. So the rest of the midpoints are pretty easy actually. So 4 and 6, that would be 5 halfway between them. 8 is halfway between 7 and 9 and 10.5 is halfway between 10 and 11. So then we go back up to list 2. And we need to just fill in the frequencies, so 10, 6, 2, 1. Okay, so the table's all filled in. You need to go to Calc. And so just if you're using the calculator, if to get these, you can press uh, F2. That, yes. So you need to look at the settings. And you need to make sure it's set up for a frequency table. Right now, this is set up for a list of numbers. It says list one, one. If you want the frequency table setting, it needs to be list one, list two. Not two, list two. So what, why that is, it's because list two is the frequency of the, the variable. And list one is the variable, as in number of pens. Okay, so that's the settings, and we press execute and one var, and you can see n is 19, so the number of bits of data is 19. That should correspond to the sum of all the frequencies, so 10 plus 6 plus 2 plus 1 is 19, so that is a very, very good check. Um, the mean, an estimate of the mean is this x with the little uh, bar over the top, you say x bar, so to three significant figures. The mean number of pens of the people of the 19 people in this survey is 3.76 pens. Um, it does say about modal class. It's not really a calculated thing. That just means which class and for class think group has the highest frequency. And that's tens the highest frequency. So the answer would be zero to three exactly as it looks. So just a quick summary. When using a group frequency table, make sure you use midpoints. Uh, make sure you set the thing up for a frequency table and the mean as it would be for, for any type of table or a list is the X with the little bar over the top.